Good morning. I'm so glad you're joining me today for our children's message. Today I wanted to talk to you about love because that's what our gospel lesson is all about. In it, Jesus tells us that out of all of his commandments, loving one another is the most important. So what does love mean? We hear that word a lot, but don't always spend a lot of time thinking about it. That's not surprising because love isn't just something we say, it's something we show. You can show love by giving a hug or a kiss, by being there for someone when they need it. You can show love by being a good listener or even making something for someone. Or you can show love by helping. That's just to name a few ways. How do you show love? Today is also an important day for showing love because it's Mother's Day. We all have many people in our lives who show us motherly care, and that's how they show us love. Moms, aunts, grandmothers, stepmoms, coaches, teachers, friends, pastors, and more. Hopefully we show them love back every day, but today is especially the day we show them love back. So isn't it perfect that today on Mother's Day, our gospel reading is all about how loving one another is the most important commandment. But loving our motherly figures in our lives is easy. And when we think of people that we love, these are probably the people that first come to our mind. But in our gospel reading today, Jesus reminds us of something important. He doesn't just say, pick a few important people to love. You know, easy ones like your mother. No, that's not what Jesus says. He tells us to love one another, period. He wants us to show our love to everyone and treat everyone with special care and kindness. Jesus means loving everyone, no matter their race, no matter their gender identity, no matter their sexual orientation, no matter what country they are from or how much money they have or don't have, whether they're old or young or whatever age they are, whether or not they're even a citizen of our country, even if they're a different religion or even if they are a total stranger. Jesus wants us to love one another, period. So think about how you will show your motherly figures love today on this Mother's Day, and then hopefully every day. But when you listen to our gospel reading, also think how you about how you will show others love. Because as Jesus reminds us, that is the most important thing, period. Let's pray. Dear God, on this Mother's Day, we give thanks for the motherly figures in our lives. We pray that you continue to watch over them and bless them. We hope that they feel our love today. We also give thanks for Jesus, who loved us and showed us how to love others. Help us to love others as you love us and as Jesus loves us. Amen.